Hey, what's up, guys? Just a quick uh, video. Actually, got a question that I'm hoping somebody might be able to answer about uh, CO2. As you can see, I'm running mine through the line here for now. Um, up into the, it's getting sucked up into the power head, and you know, you might be able to see it shooting out a little bit, shooting out a bunch of tiny bubbles. But uh, you know, there's no way to really tell how much you know it's actually being diffused. Uh, so I was hoping somebody might be able to help me answer that, uh, you know, or what a good diffuser is. I think I got this one at PetSmart like a couple years ago or something, just one I had laying around. Um, so I was just wondering how you guys that have plant tanks dissolve your CO2 into the water. And I've heard some people run it up into the intake of the canister filter, but I've heard that can uh, possibly damage the filter too, so I don't want to do anything that's going to harm the filter. Uh, but let me know. Uh, what you guys think? Um, just a question. It's been bugging me for a while. Um, still trying to find that balance. It's getting closer. I feel it, and I can see some improvement. But it's just taking some time. Uh, I think part of it is the hard water, along with the uh, the phosphates uh, in the local water, um, that's making this process a little bit slower than I had anticipated. But you know, it'll all work itself out eventually, but uh, you know, if you guys can let me know what you think about the, uh, the CO2, as you can see the shrimper having a good time over there. Um, yeah, that'd be great. Let me know what you guys think. Get back to me. Uh, appreciate it. Thanks for watching.